right, again, it's uh, Chuck Phillips with A-Liner, and we're down at the Louisville RV Show. Today, we're taking a look at the A-Liner. Uh, it's a new, new A-Liner with a titanium package on it, so it's an optional uh, package that you can buy. And uh, this is based off of one of our middle price point units, so uh, the Ranger 12 is kind of what this is based off of. So we took a middle price point uh, and made it look pretty aggressive and, and really cool. Uh, so the features on this that are different than a regular Ranger, you've got four heavy-duty stabilizer jacks, You've got 15 inch tires and wheels uh, with the with the black sport rims. Uh, we added a LED porch light instead of the regular 12 volt porch light. You got the light up uh, grab handle to get in and out of the unit nicely. Uh, we added a bunch of diamond plate even on the baggage doors, diamond black diamond plate on the front, and uh, changed the trim on this particular A-liner to a black anodized aluminum. So overall, all that stuff added up with the graphics package. This gives it a really nice sporty look, and uh, pretty much you can take this unit anywhere because it's got increased, uh, quite a bit of increased ground clearance. And on the in inside, it's basically a four sleeper. You've got a rear sofa that makes a double bed in the back, and you've got a 46 inch dinette up front, so you could sleep three to four in here comfortably. Uh, you've got a sink, stove, and refrigerator, furnace, water heater, and air conditioning. So you've got all the systems in this folding camper that you would have in a traditional travel trailer. Um, as far as construction is concerned, we use a uh, 5 8 inch structure board for the floor. The nice thing about that flooring is it's actually got a water resistant resin that's mixed with the wood strands and then there's actually a water layer, uh, a water barrier laminated to the bottom so your, your floor is never exposed to any water or road debris while you're headed down, down the road. Um, again, on these side walls are vacuum bonded lamination. Uh, you basically have your fiberglass laminated to a, a layer of foam insulation and then an interior layer of uh, Luon below the hinge because we like to screw our cabinetry into the wood. We feel like it gives a, it gives a better hold. And then above the hinge, uh, we take that inner layer and change it to the Asdell composite because uh, the way this camper folds, uh, you're actually physically lifting and moving the side walls, the, the, the A walls and the roof panels, so we want to make those as light as possible. Uh, now we'll give you a quick, uh, quick demonstration on how the A-liner goes up and down. Step one, just to make sure everything in here is below the hinge line on either side. And then on your side walls, you have two latches. You just lean in to compress the weather strips that are behind the wall. Flip down the rear lashes first. Once you take the second latch out of this wall, it releases and just folds to the countertop. Take the last latch out of the wall, unlatch the top half of the door. Step out and close both halves of the door. Give a little pull on the rear roof panel. You've got one latch on each side and you're ready to head down the road. My god, that's great. <laughs> Isn't that awesome? <laughs> that is incredible. So sweet. <laughs> that is incredible. Right, so as far as setup's concerned on this unit, it's actually uh, a lot easier than most people would imagine. You basically have road latches on each side and when you release those latches, the roof is spring-loaded, so it starts to put itself up a little bit before you do anything. And you just take the front roof panel, push it, up until it locks in, there's a channel up there. Swing the door open. Swing the front wall up, and then the rear. You're basically set up and ready to go. And that's it. If you have any more, if you need any more information, uh, go to aliner.com and you can see all the models uh, on our website.